Yeah. Hello. Hi, friends. This is Anusha Kota, and uh, I'm. I have done. My, sorry. Uh, hi, friends. This is Anusha Kota. So right now, I have been placed into a company called IPAC. It's an Indian Political Action Committee uh, in Hyderabad. The location is in Hyderabad. It's a central office. They have offices uh, all over the world, like over India in Assam, West Bengal, and everywhere. So coming to my uh, academic academics like i have done my uh, graduation in computer science and engineering stream in gmr institute of technology uh, then i have worked as a digital marketing strategist in a startup called make marketer so they have been working on uh, the big uh, the data analytics that is related to the marketing sector like the, the advanced marketing strategies and the measurement strategies that we have so i have been working on the campaign data on all the different campaigns that we run the data we get and the custom uh, custom targeting for the customers like we do the targeting based on the customer behavior and the loyal customers that we have so we have been doing the data analytics with respect to the marketing sector so then i was interested into the uh, the huge data analytics that is uh, emerging up right now let it that is the data science so then i came to know about the 360 digit emg and I joined the professional course with respect to uh, the data science and artificial intelligence. So it helped me a lot like in learning the data analytics and the data visualizations with the advanced softwares and all that. So it was very useful like the support and uh, the knowledge that is being transferred by 360 Digital TMG and all the uh, team, uh, Deepti ma'am is the faculty that who has uh, taught us data science and then uh, Sanya ma'am has taught us artificial intelligence and then i have also done uh, worked on few projects like uh, with respect to data science visualization and also uh, artificial intelligence so i've got a good support from 360 dgtmg like barini sir i would like to thank him a lot with respect to the support and uh, the knowledge that he has shared with us and sharit sir has helped us a lot with respect to the uh, support that he has given even with respect to the placement assistance like uh, i had been given the, all the goals and guidelines for the will achieving this amazing position so right now i'm into ipac as a data scientist into the advanced data analytics team so here uh, mostly we deal with the electoral data census data like as it is completely related to the political domain we'll deal with all the uh, data that is related to the political sciences like the census data and the electoral data. And we also ma major concentration of the company is on uh, NLP techniques, like mostly now within the data science domain also, we have a lot of text coming up and everything is in unstructured data and also in textual data. So most of the concentration or the focus is on the uh, NLP related techniques and using utilizing these upon uh, the real world problems that they come across while dealing with different campaigns. Like right now, they were being dealing with uh, several techniques, like they are doing the sentiment analysis with respect to English and the challenges with respect to the Indic languages, the language specific techniques that they want to work upon. So I have been into this company. It's been like uh, a one month, like I'm in the one month sector, like I'm working on the present introduction, like getting to be known, well known to the data that they're handling with. Like the main point that I choose this company is like, I was interested to get into like political sciences, like interested in politics. So I wanted to contribute my skills to the political sector. And then I have approached to the company through uh, the official portal of IPAC. Like I have uh, with my 18 interest into politics, I, I directly applied to the recruitment portal that they have and and then gone through a good uh, interview process like the response from the company was very good and then uh, we had an interview with respect to like uh, around one and a half hour the interview was with according to my general academic and professional history and also then they get into the details of my projects so we need to focus a lot upon the projects that we do and need to be uh, sound enough to answer any questions that we get with respect to the projects. And also, uh, we need to be pretty sure with everything that we keep in our resume, like whatever we mention in our resume, the skills or the skill sets, uh, the topics related to the data science or deep neural networks or anything. So we need to uh, be confident enough to 
answer any minute question with respect to any topics. So like uh, the mind map that 360 DC TMG has been providing us is very much useful. Like I have prepared upon all the topics, like uh, had a brief overview and also the in-depth, like the theoretical part and also the practical coding part of each and every topic. But even at the end, like we, uh, the mind map would be like a revision of the entire uh, entire learning that you have done till now. With respect to any topic you have, you will have a specific mind map and you can just uh, go through the flow and you do not forget even a single line. That was one thing and and most of the companies like expect uh, skills with respect to Python, SQL and the basic database knowledge and then the basic visualizations and also Excel is also important. Like right now we need advanced Excel uh, I mean, Excel tips like, which are very much helpful while dealing with the pre-processing. As we know, like we are going into different projects and dealing with different projects, the pre-processing uh, takes most of the time. So that becomes a bit easy if the uh, raw data that we have is a bit clean with the Excel techniques that we have. So they expect this Excel a bit. And right now we have uh, like very good opportunities in our company too. Like not even in our company, there are many opportunities with respect to data science. So even IPAC is in search of like a very good, well-trained data scientist then who are excelling with the skill sets of machine learning and deep neural networks, and also majorly NLP techniques. So whoever is interested can apply it to the uh, recruitment portal and maybe that would be very much useful for you as they're uh, uh, actively recruiting right now. And then uh, coming to the knowledge like Whatever uh, we are learned in 360 DGTMG DG is more than enough with respect to the theoretical part and the practical part will basically depend upon uh, the extent to which uh, you would be learning. Like at any domain, it will be depending only on the extent that you would be learning the practical knowledge with respect to the coding or uh, anything relevant to the new domains and packages like this is a new field like data science and AI you will never stop developing so we'll have a lots of packages and the older packages might be getting out and we also have the support from our institute with respect to uh, the new packages the new libraries that are, would be helpful for the easy processing of data and developing different topics and the project presentations like I was very active uh, in the projects that I have deal with and I have been leading the team for several times, like uh, coordinating with the team, all of my team members were very uh, helpful and we all worked as a team and, and got the product like till the deployment part. So being active in the projects is very much important so that this uh, live projects like what they mention is live projects has helped me a lot. Uh, while dealing with the real time projects that we get, get in the companies when we once get placed. So, uh, so it's better to like engage in all the projects and learn whatever you want. It's in the beginning, so it's better to learn whatever we uh, things we don't know from our colleagues or from our uh, mentors. And the mentors also support us a lot, like uh, with regards to any doubts that we have at any time within the office hours. Like we can get our doubts cleared. So this is all the uh, support, a uh, very good support that I've got from the Institute. Like even after the course is being completed, uh, I got all these certificates in time and like it helped me a lot in the process of the, uh, in the process of me applying to different companies. And the, the uh, project experience was very good at this Institute. Like uh, apart from like the normal projects that we have in Kagan and all that, we get a very good experience with the huge uh, data that we deal with in the real time. And this will be helpful in later on on the companies. So this is all. Uh, so this is the experience that I had, like though uh, we don't know any topic like with respect to in detail of it, like in the NLP or whatever it is, like we can have the recommended videos, like even till now, even when I get a small doubt, like we have a good uh, CRM, like the learning portal that we have that was very useful like again refer to it whenever i have any doubts like whatever doubts i have in any particular topic i can just get back to the lectures and uh let just re-listen to it and all my doubts are cleared and i can apply that on the uh, real world problem that i'm dealing with right now 
So everything lies uh, apart from the conceptual learning. We need to know the application of the whatever theoretical topics that we learn to be applied onto the real time problems and solve that. Like uh, just to give a brief, like within this one month, like I have been dealing with some uh, election data, like analyzing the post election results, like getting the vote share, like these were different metrics with respect to the domain specific. So then we had the NLP techniques, like we need to form a family tree of all the related politicians. So here the uh, scope of NLP was very high, like we need to deal with all the pre-processing techniques and uh, whatever it is, and then the clustering and all, it's like a, uh, not specific to a particular, just as we do the assignments, it's specific to a cluster combination of all the techniques that we have learned, like all the machine learning approaches that we have in order to solve the real world problem. So uh, at the end, like I wish you all a very, uh, all the best for dealing, getting the best in your future and yours. Thank you. So I'll share uh, my LinkedIn profile too. Like uh, you have any doubts or anything with respect to the recruitment process at uh, any different companies and the interview process the interview process was also very good like we it i have attended like uh, four to five interviews before uh, getting placed into this company so they were uh, coding rounds with respect to my python and sql like they wanted all the uh, basics to be tested in the interview so there were sql queries like the joins and uh, the transactions related and the procedural sql everything and in Python, uh, like we need to be pretty clear with all the data types and all that and all the basics of Python. So learning for me, like Python, I knew the basics basically, but later on, uh, I attended the workshop on the tame the Python. So that was very much useful for refreshing or brushing through my uh, basics again and getting comfortable with the coding at the higher end. So, so the coding is like uh, practicing, it doesn't come at one time, but practicing it is again and again, we just remember the code, like we need to use the packages and all that. So that is very important and that comes just by the practice. So this is what I suggest you to learn uh, with respect to the coding and the SQL that we have, the SQL database. And coming to the deployment part, like, uh, it was like uh, very new for me. Like I had deal with the web processing and website development, but deployment part in machine learning is very different. So I'm also like trying to scale up with respect to the ML ops uh, that would be very much helpful for deployment. And uh, we always need to uh, learn new things and keep learning new things. There's no end for that. So just then, then we'll reach uh, whatever goals that we have. Thank you.